Hey, good afternoon. I just wanted to share a message with you today that I think is really important. You know, it's something that I think everybody ought to know. I think it's something that sometimes gets overlooked so easily and we forget. And those of us that know it, well, sometimes we don't remember either. And I think it's really important that we be reminded of this. You know, I wish, oh, I wish when I think about years ago, I think, I really want to think about the years that I wasted, I wish I'd held on to this because I, I did forget it. I did forget this important thing. You know, this thing that I want to remind you of is not a best kept secret. It's not something that's hiding under a rock. I mean, it is out there. But we forget. And you know, there are people that are running around out there today in this world and in this society that we live in. They could be our neighbors, they could be our friends, they could be our co-workers, and they don't know this important truth. And so I think it's a good reminder that I share this with you. And as you're sitting on the edge of your seat going, all right, we'll get to it already. What do you got to say, girl? Speak it. I just want you to know that God loves you. Is that it? That's it. That's it, boy. God loves you. As you're going through your day and you are facing trials and tribulations and temptations and things get difficult, maybe the bills are late, maybe you have sickness in your family, Maybe tragedy is struck down the street. Maybe the person that you love has hurt you and walked out the door. Maybe your kids are bringing pain to you right now and you're not feeling a whole lot of love. I want you to know and remind you if you don't know it already that God loves you. He loves you for who you are. He loves you as you are. He loves you. You may not hear the three little words, I love you, from somebody that you've been waiting to hear them from for a long time, but can I just tell you that there is somebody who loves you. And his name is God. He loves you. And let me tell you, just as a reminder in case you forgot or maybe you don't even know this, but He loves you so much that He sent His Son to die on the cross for you. John 3.16 says, For God so loved the world that He sent His only one Son. Excuse me, I messed that up. One and only begotten Son. I get so excited to say it so quick. He sent His one and only Son and whosoever believe in him shall not perish but have eternal life. What a promise for us. What a promise. And a great reminder of how much God really loves us. So as you're going through your day and you're really feeling unloved and you're feeling down and you're facing trials, you're facing deadlines and pressures and just conflict, tragedy, whatever the case may be. Look, we're all dealing with something, aren't we? We are. But I want you to know that no matter what's going on, you need to know that God loves you. And you can go to Him. And you can talk to Him. And you can tell Him about all these things. God, this is what's going on today. Lord, I don't know that I can handle it. I need your help. God, are you there? Yeah. You can. And I would encourage you today that if you don't know His Son, Jesus Christ, personally, oh, my friend, Look into changing that. Because let me tell you something. A relationship with Jesus Christ. Oh, it's 
sweet. It's sweet. It'll be unlike a love relationship you have never known in your life. It's sweet. It's sweeter than the berries on the vine. I would encourage you today, if you don't know Jesus as your Lord and Savior and have that love relationship with Him, call your local church and tell them. Seek out a friend that you know loves Jesus and ask them to introduce you to the Savior of the world. The Savior who died on the cross for our sin and showed His love for us. Let's pray. Father God, I just thank you so much for your love, Lord. It's so big. Oh God, when you created us, you thought of everything. You thought of everything, God. Even love. And Father, I just thank you for that and for sending your Son to die on the cross for us. To show us that love, unconditional, unbridled, passionate love that you have for your children. God, if there's anybody that is watching this that doesn't know you personally and doesn't know what that love feels like and has never shared their love with you, oh God, that that would change today. In your son's name I pray all these things. Amen. Hey, my friend, check out God's love. It's free. There's no penalty. There's no payment. There's no contract. You're not going to get a late notice. You're not going to have to go online and pay your bill. It's not going to be conditional. It's not going to come with any strings. God's love is eternal. And if you don't know it today, I would encourage you to change that right away. Thanks for listening. Have a great day. Bye-bye.